Good morning, everybody. Today is April 12, 2016, and it is a Tuesday. Today is my day off. I do not stream today, but normally on Tuesdays, I do absolutely nothing, but I had such a motivation and inspiration to get everything in my life together that is not together. So every time I travel or any time I get sick, you get behind. I'm sure everyone can relate to this. So I spent all of today not all of it. It's noon, I woke up at eight. I've spent the last four hours organizing all of my documents needed to do my taxes for personal and for corporate. I booked a hair appointment, look at me go. I talked to my personal banker and my accountant, paid my bills for my house and stuff like that and my own personal bills and got a lot done today. It feels really good. My chest feels lighter. So I'm making some lunch, I'm making some pasta and some tuna, and then I don't really know what I'm about to do. Oh, I gotta pay more bills, I know that. But I mean, I can do that tomorrow. <laughs> so I am making, I made some tuna, and you guys, I don't like to call myself a vegetarian, okay? I don't eat meat, but I do eat fish, and that can mean whatever you want it to mean to you. I eat fish, I eat water filters like oysters, clams, mussels, and that's it. I try and stay away from tuna and salmon because it is one of the more overfished fish. I don't like to label myself, so if you want to call me a pescatarian, I believe that is the legitimate word, but this whole thing about labels when it comes to eating, I just eat what feels good to me, what I'm inspired to eat, and that's that, so. Clearing that up. Love you guys. Hey. So last night, as I have shown you, I cracked my screen. I was using my phone as a light because my family had gone to bed and all the lights were off. And I dropped it on my toe and really, really hurt my big toe. <laughs> and then I, it fell off my toe. And oh my God, this car has zero gas. I'm not taking this one. And it shattered my big toe and, wait. And it shattered my screen. So we're gonna go to the mall. I need to either get my phone fixed. I think it needs to be replaced though because when I use one of the apps I have, it's called Sleep Cycle and it monitors when you move at night. And it overheats and dries, like runs my battery when I use it. So I think there's something wrong with the motion. Is that, is that what it's like a motion sensor or whatever it is? Anyways, so we don't actually have an Apple store here, so I'm gonna go to like the Apple Care official place here and see what they can do for me. Then I'm also gonna go to my P.O. box and pick some stuff up from there. So that's the plan today. Yay, getting so much done. Okay, so we made it to the mall. I just bought a pair of sunglasses. I found these like pair of Ray-Bans and they're just black and really simple and I think they're they're cute and they look good on my face and when you find sunglasses that look good on your face you gotta keep them. So the mall's pretty quiet today because it is a Tuesday during the day. It's only like 1 p.m. so I'm gonna go and try to find the store. I think it's called iWorld and uh, get my phone taken care of. Okay, just went into iWorld and gave them my phone. They have to order an American one, even though they had my phone in stock. I bought mine when I was in San Francisco at TwitchCon because it was released that day, so I bought the new one and upgraded because I had a better camera. And anyways, now I have to wait 30 minutes for them to order the American version of my phone and then three days for it to get here. So that's fun. Also, I was looking at phone cases and then one of the employees, he was in the back room and then he came out to the front and he, all he said was to go, are you Kitty Plays? And I go, yep. 
and he goes, cool. And then he just like went back to the back room and I was like, that was, I think that is easily one of the most awkward encounters I've had yet. <laughs> and I have it in my own city. So it's really random. So now I'm gonna go and walk around the mall for a bit. I don't really need to buy anything and uh, might stop by my PO box. So I'm kind of thinking I have half an hour, I'm just gonna walk, walk to my PO box. It's so beautiful out today. So I went to Best Buy and I'm trying to buy a higher refresh monitor. I know I can order one online and I know I've been thinking about it so long that I would have gotten it in the mail online, but I wanted to see if they had any in stock so I could get it right away. But <laughs> the reason I've been waiting is I have a 23.7 inch monitor, but it's in Seattle right now at Sonia's, so I can't use that. So I'm dragging my feet on buying another one, but I'm gonna do it. I think I'm gonna order one today. And these are my new sunglasses. I like them because they're little and they're really light. Okay, so the package was way too big for me to carry. So I'm gonna walk back, get my phone, and then drive over here and get my packages. So just a few extra steps today, guys. But that's okay. Okay, so I had to go back in there to get my phone after it was fixed. And totally fixed, they actually ended up having one American phone that was identical to mine. And like, what the heck are the odds? So that was really weird. Anyways, so I talked to everybody there and they all are gamers and they all watch Twitch and they were really funny. So it is not the most awkward encounter ever. I mean, that, that was a little weird that the guy just said, are you Kitty Plays? And then kind of ran away to the back, but he, he redeemed himself and we had a good talk about how Dota is so much better than League of Legends. I got a package from, I think I already know who this is. I think it's Tragic Wardrobe or Stephanie. Hi, Stephanie. And she is amazing and she is beautiful and I love her. She's always so sweet in my chat. She's the one, if you guys follow me on Twitter, I put posted about how she did a DIY Game of Thrones dragon eggs um, for having at home as a decoration. So I posted that on my Twitter. It was her first YouTube video, but she is a vlogger or blogger. I've seen her blog. Anyways, she's really sweet. So she mentioned to me that she sent me something. And first of all, this donut wrapping paper. Stephanie, you are the cutest ever. Thank you. So we are going to open it very gracefully. It's not coffee. <laughs> what is this? Oh my god! Oh my god! Look at this! Two Kitty from Stephanie Tragic Wardrobe open all gifts in order. Are you freaking kidding me? Stephanie? What? Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, can I see cat ears? I'm already dying. Stephanie, you even turn over for your more oh my god okay stop 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 this is a stop it stephanie stephanie i'm dying this is officially the cutest freaking gift that i've actually ever received in my entire life and i haven't even opened anything so she got me this as like a housewarming <sighs> stephanie i can't i'm sorry i can't even Stephanie, thank you so much. Everyone say, I love Stephanie in the comments if you've made it this far. <laughs> I have one more box. I know who this is from. It is from my favorite loves of my life over at HyperX. I didn't think this was actually gonna make it to me because custom cu Customs called me like a hundred times and I, I don't answer 1-800 numbers so I never answered the call and so I never got to tell them that it was okay for this to clear Customs. But apparently, 
it made it. Because I see who this is from and I, I was waiting for them to send this to me. So. Ooh, wee! Would you look at those? This is their brand new headset. HyperX has come out with what they call the Revolver. I don't know too much of the information on it, but it is their brand new gaming headset. So here is this baby. I guess while we're here, I might as well unbox it. One thing that I love about HyperX is they have really, really awesome headset packaging. I just have always admired it. I have so many HyperX headsets now, and I'm really excited about them. Everyone in my family uses them, including my brother. Okay, wait, so there's the left side. Oh, there's a really lightweight. Cool, guys. Okay, I need, I'm gonna I'm gonna become acclimated with these, and it'll be interesting to see how they look when my hair is down. I mean, I don't I don't look very cute right now, but when I look cute and I wear the headset, it's my day off, guys. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. What do I put? Already recording. Oh, right on. This okay. is my outfit of the day, complete with cat inkies. I'm going down. The, um, Every time I turn on the camera, then he wants this to be held. We're going out for some food and then to the movie, my big fat Greek wedding too. I did not pick the movie. It's my mom and my sister's idea. So girls' night tonight, my day off. Lego. <laughs> So we are stopping by my house and showing it to one of my mom's friends. I actually forgot to close my screen door and it's been open for like three days because I've been at my parents, well actually no, two days. Two days it was open. So we're just uh, showing her around and then we're gonna go for sushi. All right, all right, all right. I've got a kitty cuddling me. Hi, Millie. And I think I'm gonna end the vlog here, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. Got a ton of stuff done, and now I'm just going to crash. Actually, I have to edit a video, just remembered. Yay! <laughs> but I am feeling pretty tired. Got a little Millie to cuddle with. Had a great day today. And I hope you guys enjoyed spending it with me. Tonight, the ch today the challenge is going to be, I want you, I don't know if this is going to be too much if you guys aren't ready to, to bring this to the next level, but, okay, cat butt, hello, Millie, I'm trying to film. I want you guys to tweet me a photo of your cat or dog, tweet or guinea pig. If you have a pet, I want you to take a photo of it and tweet it at me, okay? My Twitter will be linked in the description. It's at the kitty plays on Twitter, and I want you to send me a picture of your cat or dog or guinea pig or horse. If you have a pet, send me a picture. If you don't have a pet, find a picture of a cute pet and send it to me on... No, send me a picture of what your dream pet would look like. Let's do that. That's your challenge. And if you've made it to the end of the video, I'll know now. And every time I see a picture of a pet, I'll love you a long time because you watched the little video. And yeah, so that is everything for today. I love you guys so much. Thank you for spending the day with me today. And I'll see you tomorrow. Well, really, you want to say goodbye? Okay, Millie, you got to kiss the camera. That's what we do to say goodbye. Kiss it. Mm -hmm.